Hi, my name is John Lusage and I'm the CEO of the Network Security Group. 2017 now marks our 18 years in business. And the one thing I've learned after all these years is that network security is not a set it and forget it item. Hackers are always changing the way they break into your networks and your network team has to make sure it evolves with it to make sure we keep hackers on the outside, not letting them in. We've seen so many ways hackers break in, but over the last few years, we've seen they're resorting back to decades old methodologies such as social engineering. They're gonna try and convince you they're someone they're not. For example, they may try and convince you that they're one of your vendors. They may even try and convince you that they're one of your own IT staff. Here, take a look at this. Is this Lance Kier? Of course. What are you calling me for? I've just... I've been thinking about all this. We're not getting anywhere. I told you, they don't cut corners. We've tried everything. They're too smart. Too secure. Which is why I think we come at this thing a little differently. I'm listening. I think it's time to start acting like the good guys. What? What do you mean? No code, no hacking, just a phone and an internet connection. I don't know. It doesn't really sound like my style. Style? You sit in that cave of yours all day and night. Even if you did have style, no one would know. Listen, this is how it's gonna work. We're gonna use caller ID to our advantage. You're gonna call up this company and ask for the guy in IT. Then you tell him you were looking for the woman in accounting. When he transfers you, the woman in accounting will see it as a call from inside her own company. You'll actually pose as the guy in IT, and you'll tell her you need to work on her computer because there's an issue with it. From there, you'll work your magic on her, give her a link to click on, and voila. QuickBooks, social security numbers, account numbers, it's like we hit the jackpot. You're talking about social engineering. Call it what you want. We just need to start getting somewhere with this. I'm done with these small jobs. I don't know. It's simple, but it's risky. If something goes wrong, it'll catch a lot of attention. It'll be in the papers. This is what we do. You know the risk that comes with it. Now, do you want 20 grand for a few hours of work, or can I get someone else who's going to do it quicker and without the extra... No, no, I'm your man. I just... Good. I need this done by the end of the week, and if it doesn't work this time, we're cutting you loose. We'll get someone better. Alright, can I go now? Remember, you gotta do your homework first. Make sure you get their names right. You gotta blend right in. I know how this works. Thanks. I know what you're capable of. I know you're watching me right now. But you know what? I'm watching back, okay? I'll find you. I hope by now you realize that there are many ways to break into a network. It's just not brute force hacking. It's social engineering, convincing you they're someone they're not. It's phishing, 
sending you out emails trying to get you to click on something to install something on your computer so they get in. Look, network security is not a one size fits all. Our website and our phone number is on the screen in front of you. Give us a call. We'd love to work with you to secure your network.